Okay, today we're going to look at logging in to Google Classroom as a student. The first thing you're going to need to do is make sure that you are logged in to your school Google account. I can hover right here. I can see HPS at students.hamtramicschools.org. That indicates to me that it's a student account. If your 700 number is there, you're good to go. If for some reason you don't know how to log into your school Google account, I will post a link in the description area below this video with instructions on how to log into your school Google account. Once you're logged into your school Google account, the next thing you need to do is click on the waffles, and this box will show up indicating different apps that are available for your use, and we're going to click on Google Classroom. If this is the first time that you've run Google Classroom, you will be probably be prompted to give information as to whether you are a student or a teacher. I've already used it, so I'm not being prompted for that, but you will be prompted for that information, and you're going to want to say that you are a student. Once again, looking here, uh, it shows that there is a class here ready for me to join. This happens to be one from the high school. It's one that the teacher, Miss Boss, sent, sent me an invitation to join. And in order to begin using this class, all I would have to do is click the Join button. There is a second way that teachers can invite you to join a class, and that way is to use a code. So in order to do that, if you've gotten a message from your teacher saying they would like you to join a, a Google class and they have provided you a code, what you're going to do is you're going to click the plus button right here. And you have the option to create a class or join a class. You're going to join the class. In this area here is where you're going to type that code. What I'm going to do real quickly is I've got the code here uh, from a class that was set up and I'm going to just copy it, just makes it easier for me, and I'm going to do control V to paste. That code is now in here. That's the one that my teacher sent me, and I'm going to click join. Once I do that, it takes a moment. We just have to be patient. I'm now a student in that class. I, that's as simple as it is. I'm all set. The teacher will possibly send me information down in here. It'll start to show up. Um, if I go over here to people, I can see that the, who the teacher is. Stream is kind of where you're going to start. And as the teacher assigns things, you're going to see things in this classwork area. It's just that simple. Okay, but let's go back to stream. If I want to click here and I go to classes, if I'm enrolled in more than one class, they're all going to show up here. I have not joined Miss Boss class yet. I'm not going to do that during this demo. Okay. But whatever class I want to get into, I just click it, and I'm in the class. Now, you might be using a Chromebook from home if you happen to have a district-issued Chromebook or a personal Chromebook. Let me show you that. I have, I'm have going to pull this up right here. I have remoted into a school district Chromebook. Okay, I have remoted into a school district Chromebook. The demo I'm doing for you is on a Windows machine. You could do this on a Windows machine. You can get into it with a Mac, or you can get into it with a Chromebook. This is just for demo purposes. I have, I have logged into this Chromebook with my school ID. Now, I open up the web browser. It's opened up. Once again, if I hover right here, I see that I'm logged in with my school Google account. I also know that I'm logged in properly because over here under bookmarks, I'm logged in as a high school student. If I click here on bookmarks, and it gives me some of the district bookmarks. Okay, so once again, I'm now using a Chromebook, exact same process. I click the waffle, I go to classroom, and because I've already joined the class in those steps earlier, it should come right up. There's my two classes that I have been enrolled in. I've accepted this one using the code. I could join this one. I'm not going to. And all I do to start doing my classwork is click the box, and I am good to go. Once again, if you have any problems, please reach out your, to your teacher, and we'll help you work through with these issues. Um, if you don't know how to log into your school Google account, once again, I will put a link in the description area below this video. Thank you for your attention.